banking has been an integral part of human civilization for centuries, serving as a means to store and exchange value. From the earliest forms of banking in ancient Greece and Rome, to the modern banking system we know today, the industry has undergone significant changes and innovations over time. Today, banks play a crucial role in the global economy, providing financial services and products that enable individuals and businesses to invest, borrow, and manage their money. In this series of videos, we'll explore the world of banking in depth, examining the different types of banks, the services they offer, and the challenges and opportunities facing the industry. From investment banking and digital banking, to the global banking system and the future of money, we'll take a comprehensive look at the state of banking today and what it means for the future of finance. Welcome to our series of videos exploring the world of banking across history and into modern times. In this series, we'll take an in-depth look at the different types of banks, the services they offer, and the challenges and opportunities facing the industry. We'll begin by tracing the evolution of banking from its earliest forms in ancient civilizations, to the modern banking system we know today. From there, we'll delve into the complex world of investment banking, exploring the roles and responsibilities of different teams, and the process of raising capital. Next, we'll take a closer look at the growing trend of digital banking, including the emergence of mobile banking apps, online-only banks, and other fintech startups. Then, we'll examine the global banking system, including the roles of central banks, commercial banks, and investment banks in the global economy. Finally, we'll discuss the future of money and the potential disruption that cryptocurrency could bring to the banking system. Join us as we explore the fascinating world of banking and what it means for the future of finance. A brief history of banking, from ancient civilizations to modern times. Banking has been an integral part of human civilization for centuries, serving as a means to store and exchange value. From the earliest forms of banking in ancient Greece and Rome, to the modern banking system we know today, the industry has undergone significant changes and innovations over time. Early forms of banking. The first known forms of banking can be traced back to ancient civilizations like Greece, Rome, and Egypt. In these early societies, individuals and businesses would deposit their valuables with trusted individuals, who would then issue receipts that could be used to retrieve the deposited goods at a later time. One of the earliest examples of banking can be found in ancient Greece, where temples served as centers of finance and commerce. People would deposit their valuables with the temple which would then issue a receipt that could be used to withdraw the deposit at a later time. These deposits were often used to finance large public works projects, like the construction of the Parthenon. In ancient Rome, moneylenders called Argentarii played a key role in facilitating trade and commerce. These bankers would exchange different currencies and provide loans to individuals and businesses. One famous Roman banker was Lucius Caecilius Jucundus, who lived in Pompeii in the 1st century AD. Jucundus was known for his extensive banking operations and his involvement in the city's political and social life. In ancient Egypt, banks were closely tied to the temple system. The temples would serve as both financial institutions and centers of religious life, and would often hold large amounts of gold and other valuables. One famous example is the Temple of Amun at Karnak, which was one of the largest banks in ancient Egypt. As banking practices evolved over time, new techniques and innovations were introduced. For example, in medieval Europe, Jewish merchants played a key role in developing the concept of the bill of exchange, which allowed for the transfer of funds across long distances. These bills of exchange served as a precursor to modern checks and electronic payments. Overall, the history of banking is a rich and fascinating one, full of interesting figures and innovations. In the next segment of this video, we'll explore the medieval banking system, which played a key role in the development of the modern banking industry. Medieval Banking The medieval period saw significant developments in the banking industry, particularly in Europe. During this time, banks played a key role in financing trade and commerce, and many of the banking practices and institutions that we recognize today were established. One of the most famous examples of medieval banking can be found in Italy where powerful merchant families like the Medici and the Fugas established extensive banking operations. These families would finance trade ventures and lend money to individuals and businesses, and they would also invest heavily in art and architecture, which helped to promote their social and political status. In England, the rise of the wool trade led to the development of banking practices like the issuance of bills of exchange, and the establishment of credit networks. 
one famous English banker was Thomas Gresham, who served as a financial advisor to Queen Elizabeth I and helped to establish the Royal Exchange in London. In the Islamic world, banks played an important role in financing trade and commerce during the medieval period. The Islamic banking system was based on the concept of risk sharing, which allowed for more equitable distribution of profits and losses. One famous example of medieval Islamic banking is the Bank of Baghdad, which was established in the 8th century and served as a center of finance and commerce for many years. Overall, the medieval period saw significant developments in the banking industry, with new techniques and institutions being established across Europe and the Islamic world. In the next segment of this video, we'll explore the rise of investment banking, which played a key role in the growth of global finance. The Emergence of Modern Banking The emergence of modern banking can be traced back to the 17th and 18th centuries, when new banking practices and institutions were established across Europe and North America. During this time, the growth of global trade and commerce led to increased demand for banking services, and many of the institutions and practices that we recognize today were established. In England, the establishment of the Bank of England in 1694 marked a significant development in the history of modern banking. The Bank of England was founded to finance the war effort against France and to provide stability to the financial system, and it soon became one of the most powerful financial institutions in the world. The Bank of England also played a key role in the development of paper money, which became widely used across Europe and North America. In France, the establishment of the Banque de France in 1800 marked another significant development in the history of modern banking. The Banque de France was established to provide financing for the French government and to promote economic growth, and it soon became one of the most influential financial institutions in Europe. In the United States, the establishment of the First Bank of the United States in 1791 marked a significant development in the history of American banking. The First Bank of the United States was established to provide financing for the federal government and to promote economic growth, and it set the precedent for the establishment of many other banks across the country. Overall, the emergence of modern banking was a key development in the history of global finance. New techniques and institutions were established across Europe and North America, and the banking industry became a powerful force in the global economy. In the next segment of this video series, we'll explore the rise of digital banking which has transformed the way we think about banking and finance. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, share, and comment below if you have any opinion on the content. And stay tuned for the next episode where we will cover understanding the global banking system. Turn on the notification bell so you don't miss out.